Good afternoon, More Medic One here. Today, I've got a Craftsman 6.5 on the bench. It's just a push mower. Uh, the customer brought it to me because he said it was uh, low on uh, power. And I asked him, uh, does it, did it just all of a sudden just lose power? He said, no, I was mowing under my bush and I got done mowing under there and it just it wouldn't, it wouldn't rev up. I said, I said, well, probably you've uh, got something wrong with the governor spring. And I said I'd take a look at it for him this afternoon. And uh, we're going to pop this little cover off right here. And we'll see what's going on. It's just a Phillips head screw. Just go ahead and take it out. And then you can raise this up and pop it out of the way. Still not want to come out. Take it out some more. That'll do it. Okay. Well, it looks like to be able to show you what I'm going to have to do, I'm going to have to pull these screws out as well. Bear with me just one second. One here. One right here. Go ahead and lift this up out of the way. Just two screws. Yep, that's what I thought. Here's your governor spring right here. Uh, what happens is the customer pushes this machine up into a bush or something, and it actually pushes on this arm right here, if you can see it, uh, and makes the governor spring get loose. Uh, what you want to do to make this uh, engine run faster, you want to put more tension on the spring, so you want to move this arm underway. And that should be about right. And you can fine tune adjust it uh, once you get it put back together here. Uh, take you a tachometer and you want to adjust the RPMs to 3200. Go ahead and tighten on your screws back down. If you don't have a tachometer um, to check your RPMs, you can do it by ear. But if you over rev this motor, you have a chance of blowing it up. So I recommend uh, if you don't have a tack, uh, just swing it by any lawnmower shop and just say, hey, I want you to adjust the RPMs on my motor. They may charge you 20 bucks to do it, but it's probably going to be worth it. Um, if they're nice about it, they'll probably just do it for free. But uh, go ahead and finish tightening your screws and getting your other cover back on. And we'll get it cranked up and see how that sounds. If it's running too fast you just uh, put less tension on the spring and uh, that's how you adjust the governor spring or governor adjustment final governor adjustment excuse me on a Briggs and Stratton engine Tecumseh engines are a little bit different uh, they have more uh, linkages and stuff than a Briggs does but uh, other than that it's basically the same concept you want to tighten the spring on a Tecumseh uh, Onan, Kawasaki, Kohler, it's all the same principle. But uh, if you have any questions about small engines, let me know. More Medic One. Y'all have a great night.